Okay, hello. For the minimal amount of viewers that I have to my videos, who I forced to watch over MSN, but never mind. At the moment, I am bored, and bored would be a slight understatement. For the fact that I am making a blog. For those who know me, I can't keep blogs, so I highly doubt this will probably be, probably be the first and the last one that I do. If I do more, if the hey, you never know, I might find something interesting on them. Highly doubtful, because I only do them when I'm bored. <laughs> But anyway, boredom equal blog. Now, as we know, I'm not a big fan of blogs because I can't keep them. I've tried many a time, from handwritten to keeping them on disc to the live journal to even one that Gareth nicely supplied for me. Even to keeping a blog on a forum that I'm quite regular on, my posts equal over 200. I've been there for less than a few weeks, yet my blog entries equal two. So, anyway. Now explaining why I'm so bad at blogs, we will move on. Now, rambling. There's nothing like a good ramble over a nice little box of pirates. Yes, I said pirates. By pirates, of course, I mean strawberries. Strawberries are pirates. And this is the little pirate ship. No, I have not gone insane. I'm not the only person that has these views. There are others. Believe me. Anyway, rambling. What to ramble about? Well, first I think should be the obvious. The reason why I am so bored at this moment is because there is no one online to talk to, but the reason I'm up so horribly early for me, that is, me only, no one else really wakes up this soon in the morning. Well, even if it is 11 o'clock. <laughs> but yeah. The reason I'm up so early is because I have to return these. Criminal Law, Psychology Advance, and more Psychology Advance. The reason this being is because the college lends them out to us, and I finished both these courses so I have to hand the books in. I thought I could do this to my leisure, but I've had a letter sent to me in the post saying I owe them over £80. I was the first to receive this kind of letter, my friend got one last year and ended up being charged £50-odd, pounds, so, or was it more, I can't remember, she, I think one of them had over 150 but who cares, I'm not paying it, no one pays them, I'll give them the books, they can frack off. Okay, right now, I'll take my strawberries and ramble to you while I'm just off watering some plants. After what the plants, I've got to take the books back, so. New ramble. My old job. Now, if anyone knew me whilst I was hired by Ann Summers, party planner, blur, realised I had a hell of a time of it. I had no idea what I was doing. I didn't get trained until I'd been there for like two months. Yes, two months. And I decided to quit, obviously. And I've had a heck of a time quitting. Heck, I saw playing kit for rental about two months after I quit. Two months. They really like the number two. Even though it's my lucky number, they stole it and made it evil for me. Evil. Mm. Stupid answers. Anyway, I seem to have finally quit. Now, I want my certificate back. Hmm, not a hard question. But the woman that has it has also quit the company because of family issues and all of her parties she had happened to be fake parties. Yes, I know. It makes you feel oh so comfortable about working at the company, doesn't it? But yes, I have now quit the company and I want both to go back and they keep saying, ask this person, ask this person, call these people up. I spent hours on the phone calling people up just for my birth certificate. <sighs> but they tried also then telling me that I owed them £400. I was like, £400? I don't owe you £400. And that was the kit rental. And I was like, no, I don't owe you £400 for kit rental. Kit rental's £3. But the kit cost me £500, but I owed them £400. But the leaflet they sent me said I owed them £300. But Trace said I owed £500. And there's a big, messy cycle. But now I've sent a big ass box back after them. Bye bye. They can have their back. But it seems that everything has been sorted out. My last order has gone through, thankfully. Otherwise, I would have killed them because that was quite an expensive order. I've still got my diary, which I probably should have posted, but I kind of forgot, and who really cares? It's not that interesting anyway. But as soon as I was to go back, I'm good. They sent me a photocopy, so I can be happy with it. Yeah. So anyway, I'm now going to leave you to go back to whatever you were doing before you randomly decided to watch my ramblings for no particular reason, because they were rather boring. And I am going to put some 
shoes on and some socks on and trudge all the way to my college, dump some books off, tell them to screw off and I'm not paying them fifty odd pound, <sighs> they can have the books back. <laughs> Although they do say I've got one book that I handed in a year ago. So, no. Stupid library people. <sighs> Mind you, I used to be a library person. I've never done that to anyone. Okay, now I'm talking to myself. Anyway, I'm going to take these books back. Bye-bye.